Hey everybody, this is Joel Greeby here and my wife Amber and my three month old Sayla Hope. She's our little sweetheart. Um, as many know, we're doing the, the call, or the mercy suite, the call to prophetic destiny. And it's the, really the heart behind it is there's so much division right now in our nation. Uh, there's a lot of anxiety, there's a lot of fear, um, there's a lot of lies on just whatever standpoint. And um, it's hard to see clearly It's it because there's division. Um, it's been on my heart for a while, uh, but kind of entering this new season of being a father, it's really been laying heavy on me because it's not just about me and my wife anymore. It's about the next generation for my daughter. It's about the next generation that you have in your family's life. It's time for us to step up and to ask for mercy over our nation, no matter who politically gets an office, we need mercy because there's such a vision right now and we need the heart of the father to come and pour out over our cities, over our states and over our nation. And as individuals, we need to stand the gap and we need to pray. So what we're doing is we're getting together on November 5th from eight to eight and we're going to, we're going to worship, we're going to pray, we're going to intercede. And below the screen, you're going to see, um, we have a layout of, of the prayer slots we're going to do for each county in Ohio. We're, we're praying over all 88 counties. And we're going to ask you to, to sign up and just say that you're going to be praying. And we love, we really feel a call for people to come. We feel like there's something special that Lord released to you during this time. Um, so please come. We're going to be at Emerging Streams in Stryker, Ohio uh, from November 5th, 8 to 8. Um, don't miss it. It's a call. So my wife has um, had a dream. And I want her just to share a few minutes uh, of her heart. And she politically has not been involved at all. And honestly, has been kind of upset at me for being on Facebook. <laughs> and uh, this is kind of where I'm at right now. I'm like, I just want to use this as a platform for us to pray. Politically, I don't want to get on left or right sides. I just want to pray for our nation. And I want to, uh, the Lord to bring clarity um, for what he's doing and where he's moving. Yeah. I haven't been very um, involved or... Um, been honestly pretty annoyed with the political debates going on and uh, recently I just had a dream um, and it's really long but I'll just make it short <laughs> and um, it was talking the dream in my dream um, I had walked into a room and um, Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton were sitting right there yeah. and um, we walked in we're like oh my gosh so sorry and we start walking out and they're like, no, come on in. And um, Trump says, oh, congratulations, you're you're pregnant. And I was like, no, I'm not. And he goes, yeah, congratulations, you're pregnant. And I got real excited and I was like, okay, don't tell anybody yet. Um, and then, yeah. and then um, we get ready to leave and Hillary comes over and gives me a hug. And I just, everything within me just felt so, ugh, like I could just physically feel it. Um, and, um, so, uh, we ended up walking out and we're going to go tell, um, Joel about, you know, my dream in my dream, I was going to go find Joel and tell him what happened and some other things happened, but I talked about it with Joel and, and Corey and they both felt like it was, um, the Lord was just saying like, this is the time that the Lord's going to start birthing, um, governmental worship. And that's something that Joel and I carry. And we've um, seen it in the past, and we just feel like this is a time that the Lord really wants us to release that governmental worship over our country and over our state. And um, it's really just a time to intercede for the candidates and um, and for our country. And so that's where we're at. Well, she didn't say something because it's kind of could be controversial, and I'm not saying this is necessarily the Lord or anything, but I'm saying like in her dream. Um, Hillary actually kissed her and um, she said she felt this very um, strong feeling that was like, ugh. And um, no matter what happens, I'm not trying to speak bad about Hillary or Trump or anything. I, I'm just saying we just need to pray. Yeah. And uh, this is something that hasn't necessarily been on our heart, but this is, this is a season right now that it's on everybody's heart. The yeah. Lord needs to intervene. No matter who steps into that office, mm -hmm. we need clarity, we need unity, and we need the mercy of God to overflow. 
Yeah, and that's something I've been feeling is like we need to start interceding for the candidates, you know, who, no matter who um, wins or who doesn't. It's like just really strong in my heart just to, to intercede for them. So, sorry. Okay. Well, thank you guys. We love you. Be blessed. Remember, sign up below. Just say your name. Share. Please share.